Oh wow, look, it's Boba Fett. That armor is awesome. Hey, I ain't no armor. Hey guys, sorry for that cringy intro, but this is a review of Boba Fett from the Lego Star Wars Desert Skiff set 9496. At least I think that's right. I hope so. Um, he's a really cool figure. Um, I showed him in my uh, tutorial on how to build the stand you see him in in the very beginning. But let's get right into the video. Okay, this is a really good figure actually. He has leg printing, um, pretty good toe printing. Let me zoom in, I'll show you there. He has his little toe studs, um, some pockets so you can see, and even on his little, on the little cross section, you can see some metallic printing. He has some, he has the Wookiee hair that he's collected, his symbols and everything. A really good figure. You can see his helmet. He has the dings and everything. Pretty good figure for being how cheap the set was when, you, when it came out. But if we take a look at his head, this is what he was. Okay, so on his head, he has a pretty gruff expression. His face has a couple cuts on it, just being a tough warrior guy. He's some good five o'clock shadows. And on the back, you don't actually see anything. It's all blank. But it's still really good face printing. Uh, one of the best for a cheap figure. So if we move on to the back here, you can see his jetpack. This is the newer mold, um, and it's pretty good. He has a shoulder pauldron as well. He has no back printing, unfortunately, but for such a good figure, it's good enough, I guess. Um, yeah, he's pretty much all around pretty good figure. Lots of metallic, different stuff. His helmet looks really nice. It has all the detailing you could ever ask for. Um, yeah, pretty good figure. That's all I have to say about it. Thanks for watching the video, guys. Have a good day.